Hello everyone, uh, this is John, uh, data science career transition expert. Welcome you all to this another educational uh, video on data science and artificial intelligence. So today I would like to talk one of the very important topic or very confusing topic when learners wanted to start learning data science. Whenever you wanted to learn data science or artificial intelligence, you always feel confused about these terms like somebody is saying data science, someone is saying artificial intelligence. Oh my God, what is this uh, data science, artificial intelligence? So this terminology is becoming a big jargon for learners who wanted to learn data science from the scratch. So today I'm just going to present you uh, one um, the content with you all so that you can understand the differences between this data science and artificial intelligence. So here I'm sharing my screen. Let us all get into this. See data science, artificial intelligence I've just quoted. Artificial intelligence has father. Data science, no one. Meaning, there is somebody who coined this term artificial intelligence. So that person name, here let me share my screen. Here if you see, John McCarthy is the founder of artificial intelligence. Meaning, someone has coined this term artificial intelligence. His name is John McCarthy. But again, I got a thought, who coined this term data science? Again, I went and Googled it. I got that so there is no father of data science. Okay, then artificial intelligence has been coined by John McCarthy. Data science has not coined by anybody. This is the first point. Okay. Now, the next two point here I just mentioned, if you see the screen, see, father, John McCarthy, 1956, he coined the term. Okay. There are some similarities. Similarities is nothing but um, the artificial intelligence is just a term. Data science is again a term. Term meaning, let's say uh, John is a human. Human is a term, right? So when I wanted to say John is a human, there are some attributes which want to contribute like eyes, I need to talk, I need to uh, have some kind of intelligence factor. So everything is contributing towards uh, John is a human, right? This is what they're saying. So in a similar way, artificial intelligence is just a term and data science is again a term, just like how we are going to call humans. Okay, now what is the term definition? Let's get into this. Artificial intelligence, according to the term, feeding human intelligence behind computers or any machines which will take decisions and actions that humans are supposed to take when you see that we call that as an ai meaning what feed let me read it slowly feeding human intelligence behind computers or any machines for example let's say when you are going to browse uh, the items let's say you wanted to buy one smartwatch right so you are just going and googling and amazon give you one um, uh, realme smartwatch so if you see it is deciding what exactly it need to recommend where this computer or a web application or a mobile application it is deciding what items it need to recommend to you where well, the same thing if you go to a shop right a human if you say hey i want realme watch the other person will say hey yeah these are all the other brands he will suggest you now this web application is suggesting you so we look at to, we look into this web application and say hey there is an ai behind this chat gpt right so where we are just asking some question hey what is the definition of this uh, artificial intelligence it is trying to respond to us so where there is an ai so make this statement in a better way so like how we are going to ask our uh, english speaking friend hey I, I, I wanted to make this statement in a better way he would suggest us right so where this human intelligence is behind this web application now that is chat gpt so whenever we are seeing that's what here here have written uh, uh, feeding human intelligence behind computers or machines which will take decisions and actions that humans are supposed to take when you see that that we call it as an artificial intelligence like human intelligence we fit behind machines artificial intelligence okay then what is this term data science is all about see data science is nothing but solving the client's problem with the help of data and propose new solutions to increase the revenue see this the point is nothing but we need data Science is nothing but what? We study the past histories and we try to invent new solutions, right? In the similar way, with respect to data, the client will come up with a problem. So we take the particular data and we need to address the client's problem so that the client will get a huge revenue out of it. So this is again just a terminology based on a lot of practices, uh, researchers or the practitioners, they gave this particular term data science. Again, it is just a term. But in order to implement this artificial intelligence or data science related practices, there are something in common. Here I just listed tools and skills required in common. So the top priority, if you wanted to give solutions based on artificial intelligence or data science, is nothing but you should be good in Python programming, SQL, that is one database, machine learning, 
deep learning, natural language processing, and time series modeling. And this is very top priority skills. And add-on skills, what you can have is Excel knowledge, Tableau, Power BI, and R programming language. These are all the add-on skills. And soft skills is good communication skills. So this communication skills plays a huge role in all the IT companies here. So, uh, but the top priority is something which I listed that is very, very important if you wanted to build an AI project or a data science related solutions, right? So, and again, there are some use cases also in common here. I just give and see this use cases. That is Amazon.in, like I've already told you how one item, if you click on it, it is recommending the best next items. Self-driving cars, like it is only deciding, uh, you know, whether I need to take a left turn or a U-turn or by whether this is a red color light or a green color light, this itself it is saying. Automatic detection of number plate, like um, whenever there is a signal, if you cross this, uh, you know, with that uh, white color line, automatically your number plate must be detected and it will get uploaded to the database and you will get a message notification, right? Again, there is an AA behind this web, 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 so web camera, what it is actually installed. Extracting information from a text uh, document, particularly used for this bank. There is bank uh, companies, what exactly they are doing is, there is where we are writing this Chalon or a DD, right? So when you scan this automatically, the uh, beneficiary name, whatever it is written, the amount, it needs to get extracted and automatically stored into the database. So where from a text to document, information extraction has to happen and stored into this particular web application. So where, again, behind the scanner, we have fixed one um, web application, sorry, uh, intelligence part, that is an AI, or if you are using a software to take that particular, whenever we are scanning, the information, if it is, has to be extracted, there is an AI behind this. So we don't see this, and again, the final takeaway point here I just mentioned is nothing, but people will uh, will always say there is an AI behind the application, but they don't say there is a data science behind this application because See this, why? Because data science is just a term. With data, we are inventing new solutions. But once it has been deployed, it is called as an AI. So let me just wrap it up. Artificial intelligence is nothing but a terminology. Data science is again a terminology. Why this particular artificial intelligence came into the picture? There is a father, that is John McCarthy. He came with a lot of practices and he said, human intelligence, if it is fed behind this web application or something, and this web application will take automatic decisions and actions by itself. That's what artificial intelligence. He properly defined it and he released one paper according to that. But data science, there is no such paper got released. There is no father also. But with the data, as we are providing solutions, uh, practitioners, they gave this particular term data science. So in order to implement that, there are few skills which are in common here I just given and uh, common use cases. And the takeaway here I just said is nothing but we call something like there in this particular uh, web application, there is an AI. Behind this, there is an AI. But we don't say there is data science behind it because that's something to understand uh, there's nothing but with data, we are trying to provide solutions. So in order to implement these two things, we need Python. A machine learning, deep learning, natural language processing, time series modeling. So if you wanted to learn all these things in depth, so feel free to reach out to us. So we are providing uh, in-depth knowledge related to industries, what exactly it is required. So feel free. I will be talking more about this in our uh, uh, day one session, basically. So feel free to reach out to the number which is given below. Let's talk in detail what exactly these concepts are in the uh, in our demo session or in our day one session, where we are exactly going to have a deep understanding on this particular topics. I hope this uh, content helped you to understand the terminology differences between artificial intelligence and machine learning. If you like this, uh, you can just give a thumbs up or you can just comment down what is the next topic that we would uh, need to talk. So definitely we will be addressing that. Thank you so much. Have a good day. We'll see you in the next video. Bye now.